final event or a story, and it's, it's a letter I wrote to my past, my past life on the flight over here. I don't believe in being perfect, for if we were perfect, we'd have nothing to work on, nothing to fix. Imperfections are actually a beautiful thing. Four years ago, I found myself sleeping on an air mattress with no place to call home, no car, no food. Sat thousands in debt and a cell phone shut off. The only thing I had left was the ability to dream. I was faced with a choice, we were faced with choices every day. Choices require decisions. I made a decision to not only attend an event like the one you guys have experienced this weekend, but to be present at that event. To listen, to attain information, to gain better friendships, and most importantly, allow what I was about to learn to become a new fuel for life. So since then, I was blessed by an ambassador pastor before I came up here to speak to I sleep in a king bed with a fireplace in front of it, and then I'm room in my new house to sleep as well, with my own urinal in my bathroom. In a BMW, I'm giving my brother because I want a new one. And in the backseat of the BMW are hundreds of receipts for the dinners I've had. And next to that are hundreds of empty packets of a healthy shake I consume for free. And two weeks ago, I threw away all the letters from creditors I paid off right after I looked at an unlimited cell phone plan with 20,000 texts I used in a month. <laughs> after that, I went shopping for a black and white outfit for a party I'm going tomorrow with 6,000 of my new friends and a team of people that own the fast growing company in the drug sales industry, industry. And I get to meet with the Colleen, Master P, and Little Romeo, my favorite Hulk Hogan. And I say this because at the last event, it was an amazing experience. What can this event do for you to see my mom who I think Hulk's sleep beat up Blake? <laughs> but, but, but to see my father, who never gets out of the house, look like a child again when his eyes were glowing because he got to see you. So. On the flight over here.
Vanner calls me and Chris and found me in Success Magazine, and he is on the top of my best friends now, and he's going to be a nice ambassador too. I see marriages brought back together, a doctor and his wife that inspire an entire city. Two people who want a transformation vacation and now make $20,000 plus a month. A team of people that are going to run an awesome course to face their fears. And I think of the call I got an hour before I went up here. About a woman who had her computer stolen and her cell phone taken away in Arizona just yesterday. Who still made the trip out from Arizona by herself to find out her transmission went out when she got here. And you know what she did? She was so, so inspired by going in this room. She went and got a free BMW. She went and got a BMW, excuse me, knowing it's going to be free sooner or later.